Hello, Dexy. No, glitchless. Any percent is garbage category. I will try. Jake. I'm just I'm tired of mine being a complete mess. I needed a haircut when the lockdown started and it's like three and a half months on from now. Two and a half. How often do I wash that hat? What, the, the Pokemon one? You wash hats? Never, but I don't really wear it unless it's on stream. It gets worn for like maybe 30 minutes across all a week. It's not like I sweat into it or anything like that. Not like most baseball caps where if you go out in them and actually wear them about and they're clinging to your head the entire time, don't you? They end up a bit gross. This one's just worn indoors in cool temperatures. And it's not really worn either because it doesn't felt my head. <laughs> it just sits on top of it. I 
I have a big head, so I have uh, trouble finding hats that fit. Read into that what you will. Follow Tad, please. T one. perfect encounters. You love to see it. It's kind of a shame this is second try Mudkip, but still. Sub-16 is possible, I guess on either, really. although it's ridiculous. <laughs> it's like actually crazy. It is possible.
Shand attack. Oh, that's Mud Slap. God, level 8 is just so fucking good here. And that's that turn two and three, and I still four hit the boot. GG's. doing it. <laughs> I even thought about it after the goddamn aqua boot fight and still went that way. Muscle memory too strong. This is the other advantage of uh, this early experience route is that you barely take any damage on this journey. Oh wow, and we got the crit. So a five turn fight rather than a six. It's like yeah, the low tad takes three turns, but we save one back on pooch and one here, and we nearly always save having to potion at like any fucking point. I mean, look at this. Literally didn't even need to potion before Ethelberg Forest because I haven't taken any fucking damage yet. <laughs> Ridiculous. <coughs> now the experience is too good. House tackle. I think my coin. I don't think it has any other attack. What would have to go wrong for Roxanne Split to be 18 minutes encounters? Just more encounters than what I got. Um, you can still get sand attack miss on Pooch. Roxanne's nose pass can still be slow. Yeah, I think so. It might not. Well, that, that I think that would be weirder if it didn't, and it only tackled anyway. But yeah, it's weird that. Well, it kind of is and isn't because I think the level ten is correct for its move set at level ten. I don't think Judy has anything other than like. Oh well, no, because it should have defense go. Yeah, the other ones having mud slap is a bit weird in a way. Because I don't think they'll learn it that early. Oh man. Yeah, it would definitely be weird if it did have all the other moves and it only ever tackled anyway. So that would suggest AI being strange, but I don't understand why it would be stranger him and not strange to the rest. Gee, I wonder if I'll be growling at this HP. <laughs> Level 14. Yeah, no, I agree. It is weird. Can we magic crit again? Last time I did this route, I was pretty much at this point and magic crit for a, a 17 flat. Nice 12. <laughs> I was rolling 12 with Rock Tomb. Let's fucking go. Let's go straight in with the tackles, please, as well. Don't dick about. I need the damage. I actually don't know what to do. 
Yeah, I don't know what the range is for Rock Tomb. I think he'll knock me to 14 and that will be questionable. Hmm. Are the experience lost here because if I was a level 13 that would have been taunt. Vince just tackle? Oh neat, okay. Actually kinda won. Long fight, but torrent afterwards is not bad. At this point, Catanese, you could just say 500 and I don't know what you mean. Not like I ever call you on your bet anyway. These days I'll hit full Monty and Cat and he'll be happy. Well, by the way, uh, this is possibly the worst bet you could have made because it is literally impossible because of the extra steps taken for early experience route. I literally cannot hit full Monty. If I hit the frame for full Monty, I just won't find anything. I take extra steps to do early experience and I just accept the fact that I can't hit full one Because I never hit it in runs anyway. I'm so used to saying easy zigzag. Do you know, I actually missed that he'd said that as well? I was reading through some of it. I saw that he was being a bit weird, but I missed that he said what he did. <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Kind of regrets putting what I did now, because I probably shouldn't have made as light of it. Light of the situation, if I realised. I was just like, okay, mate. Discord seems to attract these weirdos. I think it was a troll, yeah. There's a lot of people that do weird like that. Weird shit like that at the moment. Just like, show up and it seems like they're genuine. But then they act like, either super entitled or just super fucking weird. And it's like they kind of want to be part of the community and ask questions and stuff, but you're also just being such a fucking odd person. Teehee <laughs> Torrent.
Aaron. Uh, what are you on about, Arm? What am I trying to say? I didn't redeem really insult me. I wasn't saying anything to you. Oh, right, hey, yeah, okay, I get the joke. Christ, something like that. This is first attempt of the day again. Yesterday's first attempt went quite well. I know, that was intentional. Early experience throws this split off entirely. The evolution gets moved to the earlier split, and you end up golding rival two every time. Ty there, always worth mentioning. Yeah, just the you or I arm, and it just took me a moment to realise where you were going with it. What you said also came like three minutes after I'd said it, which threw me off. Uh, yeah, it's, it's partly your fault. Fuck you. Donate to cure all of my illnesses. Thank you. Ideal health leaving Roxanne uh, nine once the nose pass is dead, or eleven after the normal level up to uh, fourteen. Uh, so leaving Roxanne, Roxanne would be eleven. Although anything lower is just as good. It's just that you don't get the red bar beep at eleven, which is quite nice. If you don't like that when you do in the minute. But otherwise there's functionally no difference between 11 and anything below. A normal menu here, but I have to buy one less than max revives. If I buy a maximum, I'll buy six. I keep overshooting that. Another huge advantage of early experience is how good the potion count is. Like, I haven't actually used a potion this run yet. <laughs> I still have all five, I'm fairly sure. To the point where I'm wondering if I can get away with buying a lot less. If I know I'm doing early experience. But I don't know what. Because I could probably buy like two or three. Oh no, I've used one. Sorry, that's a lie. I've got four left. I could probably buy three and be perfectly comfortable most of the time. That saves $600. I don't really know what I'd use that for. That's right. Who do you skip if you beat the high craft chain? Nothing. You just get to th one shot the Carvana in the museum fight. So you fight a one move trainer to save two moves later on. Thanks, Drake. You also potentially save another turn in Rival 2 as well if you hit the Wingle range. Pinball on Sunday. 
capture them all. Definitely planning to do it this Sunday a couple of weeks ago. <laughs> I kind of forgot about it since, I haven't really said anything, but I might do that. I might still do it. I might, I might, I might. Yeah, I think so, Drake. Sizzle. I'll probably see how I am on Saturday, see how I feel, and then if I'm feeling good, I'll do it. Oh, oh fuck you, Sizzle. Hello? <laughs> okay. I think that's because I was trying to stretch. <laughs> that was embarrassingly bad. <laughs> I just got confused. I went <laughs> right one tile too early. And then I was just really fucking confused for a bit as to why I couldn't walk up. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> so I just... My brain just died, okay? I'm just chilling on the lounger, don't worry about it. That was about time for me to stretch, I think. <laughs> Gee, Amoeba, why did you lose five seconds on Slateport Beach? None of your fucking business. For a general gauge of how good this time is, a good time finishes the next fight sub 30. So I think we're, we're just going to miss the cutoff for a good time. But we're pretty close. Especially considering my rock sound was okay. Doubter, let's go. Who's the money bags doubter? <laughs> Sup, Drake? I see you. Bags believers now. Big money being thrown about in these bets right now. T 
TY for not growl. Nice crit, Lena. Double crit, Isabel. You are fucking dead. One of your Pokemon dead. Don't give me your number because you too will be dead. <laughs> You're fucking dead. Do you hear me? You're dead. to get me. Oh, this health is kind of doo-doo. If I get triple ember no burn, no crit, I may just risk it. Because I only die to the top two rounds. End the prediction, by the way. Thank you. Lots of those, please. No burn, at least. No. no. Bruh. I was probably gonna have to heal on Grove Island. It has been so long since I've had less than like five turns sleep. Holy shit. Every run that gets here. <laughs> the longest possible sleep. In fact, you can wake up on turn two. Likely fine. <laughs> Come on, we'll go get him. Fuck off. Oh, we hit the range. You love to see it. Early experience paying its way. good of a lead as I was hoping it was going to be, but I think I needed a good rival 2 fight for that to happen.
it does take a lot of practice. You get used to it over time though. But it's still difficult. Still not reasonable to expect to be 100% consistent with it. Ziggy range, ziggy range. Is it twice yesterday, ziggy range? It's all probably missed. Headbutt. Mm, that's okay as long as I hit. Hmm. Oh, this is quite slow. for that because I hit level 22 and I know it's pretty close to a range. Okay. Well that's put a, a fairly sizable hole in my lead now. That fight can be two turns and it was five. I've still got a 15 second lead, I probably will. Otherwise, I won't.
Nah, fuck it, I'm gonna get protein. I really like getting protein. <laughs> it just fucking makes everything so much better. I don't want to keep resetting runs in the early game. I think it makes sense on a lot of runs. Like, I'm really struggling justifying not getting it anymore. <laughs> Unless your run is like absolute dog shite, in which case I'd probably reset it before then anyway. Guys. Okay. Thanks, old man. <laughs> Moved as soon as he could, and in the one direction that would fuck me. if I've done early experience. Doesn't really matter. It's only time lost if I get the quiet red plaza. I just don't get it, LMAO. setting. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh... I don't think I had it on sharp. I can't tell because I can't read Japanese. <laughs> Which one sharp is. Okay, I think this is the good setting. This is much better. I thought my eyes were going funny for a while. I think it's uh, we had that wrong setting up. I don't need to wait for the hiker. I've already fought it. <laughs> I could have gone the first spin and forgot. I wonder if there's any way of. Hmm. No, I imagine there isn't. 
I don't know if running onto the tile that's two to the left of him would force him to run to look right, but I don't think it would. This run is not that good, holy shit. Chunk of time save across Brawly and Norman. Thanks, PV. So, if luck is on my side, we can be uh, a bit ahead. Well, actually, can we be ahead at Brawly? Uh, we can be ahead at Norman. I don't know if we can be ahead at Brawly though. No, we can be ahead at Brawly. We can't be sub one ahead. That's what I'm thinking of. I don't know which Anon it was that gave, uh, well, clearly don't know because it's anonymous, but you know. It was weird that the only anonymous gift sub I got was for Bot got this. I just thought it was uh... a. <laughs> I just thought it was a dig at Shiru's mum, just in general, because this run is bad. name like this. Gather your cat jams.
treasure. Please don't double bite me. Thank you. Ooh. Neat. I love to see it. Protein price and spinners just not being very friendly. Execution was okay, nothing special. But... Certainly no significant time loss. Fuck that, just take it. <laughs> okay, if he's spun, we'll have it. Manipulous Emma? <laughs> Tell me a moment, keep that. That's crit. Totally necessary. Light screen? TY? <laughs> no, it's Sizzle, you should just go and check the general channel. <laughs> I don't understand the context of Keep House's joke. Read the stuff that was posted this morning slash last night. No power? Threat to some very nice flannery fights. And it is a treat. I must tell you this much. Tom's HP was. I'm hoping it was high 50s, low 60s.
I'm a little scared for Swallow, but it should be fine. He crits me there after heal before spin damage is ugh. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> oh, why do I keep making this mistake? Why do I keep going so low on this path? There's like no fucking reason. Deserved. At least I finally got punished for it. That's <laughs> 69 versus 420. Yeah, leave it as it is. Let the donuts lie. To be honest, as well, I missed that he'd said it. But, yeah. Because I responded with something, but I didn't read the entire conversation. I mean, at this point, just I think it's probably better to leave it and wait and see if he does anything else, because he may have just fucked off now. But if, you s if we start going in and being like, you're a prick, and potentially gets the reaction he wants. Wow, that's running garbage. Hot garbage. Please may I get a Wawa Norman. Specifically the Wawa Norman that was like a 545. Yeah, it's fair sizzle, but at the same time, if they've just come in for a one time being a weirdo and we don't rise to it, then they might just piss off. If they start saying something again, then yeah, I think that's a fair thing. But it's like almost worse to acknowledge it and give them a reaction if they didn't really get anything in the first place. Especially, I think we said something about not saying it anyway. So yeah, it's like. It's a weird thing, because I think in an ideal world, yeah, it would make more sense to just be like, or you, don't be a prick. But we almost invite more shit posting by doing it. Please don't crit me. Please especially don't crit me, because you will kill me. 16. Mm. may go for Dizzy Punch because it may kill. Mm. Do I risk this? I think the roll is 16 to 18. I don't think I risk this. I think I just heal. Can we just crit? Neat. 
you've got the HP to tank it, it's better to just go with that. Easy game, he says, before Jody and Norman. Fool. This worked yesterday. It did not work today. Uh, Saudi Waddies again? Okay. Uh, no, I'm just dead, aren't I? No, because it heals. I have to hit the range this time. But leaving him on green health here is like probably dead. <laughs> probably dead. Can still kill. Oh, wow, okay. This has been a shite normal split. I have just got that turn 4 roll on turn 2 and it have all been good. But, you know. Right, can I get 40 to dances into a facade? I'll just hit the Vigoroth range and save a shitload of time. There's one. Dude, chill. Can't wait to die. No, that's the most optimal. Because then you don't have to heal. Because he would have left me on 67, I'd have hit the Vigoroth range, then I'd have killed by noon, and I'd have been a good help for slacking. It's actually better than double facade, it's just that double facade is great over every other option. Don't crit me, lol. Protein only for Vigoroth? No? Mm -hmm. A hell of a question, Sizzle. Protein is for many things. What's the upside? Many, many things. Um, where do we start? Um, please give me a drop. Camera up, Flannery's camera up goes from a 15 and 16 range to guaranteed. Uh, for all these Makahiti, you can strength instead of Mudshot. It's a 94% range, and if you miss, you just strength turn 2, whereas missing Mudshot is like a 4 turn fight afterwards. Uh, actually, was not too bad of a split. <laughs> only lost nine seconds to record. That's actually not too bad. Um, Spinder in the gym, you can strength turn one instead of mudshot. Zangoose goes from a. I think it's a 30% range to a 60% range to two shot it. You can strength Spinder after 2x attacks on Norman if you don't get T to dance. Vigoroth goes from a 50 to a, a high 60% range. You can strength fly noon rather than mud shot it. Rival 3's Grovile becomes guaranteed. Three hit KO range on the Gyarados has improved. Yes, we have a Black Seed. We have protein. This is a protein drum. Proteined out of my fucking mind.
Oh, Cassini's just had the pace spin while I was rattling everything off. Peepaz, could you add that as a command? Oh. God, I'm so... I don't know why I have that muscle memory, so just not repel that. How's that going to throw my repel timing off later? I don't think it will, particularly. Yeah, if you just do, like, exclamation mark pers and benefits. Something. Persim. Fucking protein benefits. I love it, yeah. <laughs> Fucking Persim. Damn. It was almost good, and then it ended up being a two bunker again. <laughs> All part of my master plan. <laughs> I'm a genius. Oh no. No, don't fucking leave it as that. If we're gonna have a person benefits command, it should just say no or something. <laughs> Really fucking obnoxious. None. I hate you. Oh no, it's protein benefits, never mind. I like you, thank you for being my best mod. TY, TY, TY. This run is most not good. Sometimes I think they are. I hate fucking person. <laughs> There's never a benefit for person. Fuck person. Alright, it's time to get a rival three best one. Part one is the spinner. This is not a friend. Part two is hitting this mighty Anna range. Disc uh, what kind of RPG? Like turn based? Pokemon style? Or JRPG? Or what? Western RPG? I don't know why I'm asking, I don't really have very many suggestions. I barely play any games outside of speedrunning anymore. Not JRPG and not Memorpage. Uh. Discaya. It's turn based though. Oh no, it's JRPG, never mind. No, it's not turn based JRPG. Uh, I don't know then. I don't really play RPGs that much. Three of my master plan to best split this split is to crit the Pelipper turn two. And to be honest, it's the only real key part. Even with all the rest of the mistakes in this split, I will definitely best if I crit Pelipper turn two. Oh, I'm 
don't get burned by the slug or anything stupid. I can still strike. I cannot strike. I've not heard good things about that series, Armin. I won't lie. I've heard that they're a bit repetitive. Never have outrange in this house. I could not get into Witcher 3. I've tried twice. And I cannot get into it. Here we go. Wow, he let me three turn there. It was actually a good score, I think. that you'd actually slept. Unless you just did it quietly. trees, bro. initially. And all the difficult bits fine though. And just bonked in two stupid places. Ugh. Ugh. My Pokemon menus seem to get slower and slower every time I get there as well. Da -da 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 -da. Gold split the Winona split. 
that is my master plan for this run. I'm going to gold split Winona, because I can. We can get like a 10 second best. Then I'm going to gold split TNL. Because I could get like a 20 second best there with a pretty normal split. And then this will be a good run. <laughs> Instead of an okay one. Part one of my gold splitting Winona master plan is to kill the Carvana. Not this Carvana. Well, I need to kill this Carvana. The Carvana is coming up. I'm going to shockwave it and it is going to die. And then the rest of the fight will be good. Part two is I'm going to crit the Pelipper in the double fight. Like I said I would in the Rival 3 split, except this time it will happen. Actually going to crit the Pelipper. And save a million years. And then we're going to live on Tropius with good health. And then I'm not going to get Perish Song. And we will have the best Winona split in the world. Part one, cast one. Failed from the get-go. Right, I'm just gonna hit the Zubat range and it's not gonna be much time loss at all. Easy. That's not great. Archer, does that work out? Do I outspeed the Zubat? No. Oh, this could be quite bad. Ah, wrong one. Yay! Okay. That was actually relatively fast in the end. Not the best, but still fine. Added. Sometimes I forget. It's literally only that fight that it matters, really. I think. Unless somehow this Pelipper gets a turn off and hits Super Zonic. Which it won't. On part two of the master plan, please help me with it. It's a good quick attack. This is bad, this is very bad. This turn was basically worthless. Oh, that crit's okay. That endeavor is terrible. <laughs> That's horrifically bad. Um, oof. TBH. Forty-four special. This is terrible. 
Holy shit, this is a very, very bad setup. 44 special events. Um. No, I don't think it matters. I don't think it will matter anyway. Neither why are you going straight in without healing? Because my cast form outspeeds. And I'm hoping it will get two shots off. And maybe you are dying. I am dying. Me, but why did you surf the trophies? It was more damage than strength in time. Double miss there would have actually been crazy fucking good, by the way. <laughs> it would have been so, so unlikely. Right, please get the two hit. That's a good roll. Don't crit me. Yeah, that worked out nicely. Castle's now at good health. Didn't need to heal Swampert. I'm a genius. <laughs> I mean, if you're going to perish zombie, this run's probably an okay one to do it. Like, <laughs> this run is not that special, really. Feel free. I don't mind if you don't, don't mind if you do. Not the end of the world either, which way. seconds to the record in the Winona spot. Turn four supersonic? Maybe? Never. Now I'll cause the double protect. Of course it works. Our champ. Fuck Pelipper. You want blue? She don't want blue. I got you blue. I don't understand why that says sometimes I think there are, because I literally never think there are. Lost exactly 30 seconds, let's go. <laughs> Shit. I'm with Chiru on person. I don't think it's worth it. I feel like I'm starting to convince him on protein. Or we are. Not just me. Man, I keep doing that. I hope he's not lumping me in with that. Fuck person.
Fuck your persons. I've been doing all of the safety strats at the moment. I'm not doing persim because it's so dumb. Safety straps Ringo does, although I'm doing a slightly more optimized uh, protein. Actually, I'm doing more because I'm doing early experience, which is technically safety. Although I actually think it's faster on average. But yeah, Ringo absolutely could have had a world record if he wanted to. Uh, there isn't really a safety strat in this run. Like, I think early experience saves time on average. I think protein saves time on average. Like, yeah, it loses time to the top end, but you aren't going to be playing at top end every run. In fact, you're very rarely going to be playing at top end. I think protein and early experience are better if you want to grind for record, because record isn't perfect. It never will be perfect either. And I don't think we're at the stage where saving, you know, the 15 seconds it takes to pick up protein is ever going to be worth it. I think you're going to be looking at low 229 before that starts coming into consideration. Definitely not Jake. Shiryu does not think protein is worth it. Um, Wave generally does not get protein unless the run is astoundingly good. If he gets an astoundingly good start, he will pick it up, otherwise he doesn't. Um, Japanese runners tend to. Ringo and Dexy both like protein. Uh, I don't think Poke Guy ever got it, so I think he's probably in the same kind of camp as Wave. He might pick it up on an insanely good run. Otherwise he won't. Forty-nine defense. I'm worried that that's a little high. Thank you, Rocker, thanks. I don't think it matters too much because my Castle's HP is like fifty. No, yeah, it'll be fine. No way, no, really. To be honest, the run's not too brutal on in terms of like dying. It's just the it's got a high level of variance. And there's lots of splits where. really easy to just lose a shitload of time. Right, we lost WR pace to Maxi2 yesterday. We're <laughs> nowhere near that pace today. 
but this is an okay run and I would appreciate being allowed to pass this time. TY. Crit the Crobat to finally gold this split. One day I'll crit this fucking Crobat. One day. That'll probably be the world record run. <laughs> it's the run that I finally crit. Maxi 2's Crobat. Technically I did get it last time. I got a crit from Crobat. You cheeky shit. I need to crit the Crobat. I always said back in like 2015 when I was running Emerald that the run that I finally get sub 1 Flannery would be the world record run and it literally was. The very first run that I got sub 1 Flannery was the whatever, the 236 or whatever the hell that record was at the time. And the new one will be critting this Crobat. That was a cleanish split, other than the spinner fuck up. Can you die from max range wing attack? Yes. Wing attack's max roll is 30. Air cutter you can't die to the max roll. You get a higher crit rate from air cutter so you actually want to see wing attack because you're only 1 in 8 to die to wing attack oh no I suppose it's exactly the same 1 in 8 yeah, 1 in 16 to crit 1 in 16 to max roll and then air cutter's 1 in 8 to crit and any of those kill you wow I guess it's exactly the same I always thought wing attack was better but it's not Like scaling down emotes is like an art form. Like amoeba hype doesn't scale down amazingly. Not bad, but but that's the same for a lot of them. I feel like amoeba smug doesn't look as smug as if you zoom in on it. And then like amoeba W looks far more panicked if you zoom in on it than it does at normal size. Emotes are an art. Please hit the cap out of range. I think it will be a range just. The sunglasses on that really don't work in a very funny way. <laughs> I just look like I'm blind and I really struggled to put the glasses on.
Uh, right, Gyarados, please. We haven't had a bad Gyarados for a while. Which is not a good time for this run. Bite isn't terrible, but Leah is the better one. That's crap. Ah, oh, that's a bad Gyarados. What's the option from here? I thought she did spawn. I thought she was spawn when I went into that fight. 65 health. What do I do? This is like the worst possible health. Double Dragon Rage is terrible. I think I just do strat 3. Just energy powder to strat 3. What's the best option? I don't know. I could energy powder and do strat 5 and just hope it works, but it's kind of dumb from that high health. That's the slowest possible option, holy shit. That costs so much time. <laughs> Jesus fuck. See, the thing that's swaying me here is that if I do strap... I can heal, and then it it's strap three. Which is already risky-ish. I also have to heal as a separate menu. Whereas if I do strat 5, I'm risking this high health. I need like really good rolls on the clay doll, but I can heal in the fight. And if I get the good rolls, everything's fucking peachy. I almost just want to risk strat 5. Because I'm like 2 HP off of the cutoff for it anyway. Yeah, I think it makes more sense when it's this close. But I don't know, I don't know if like the HP values factor that in. I don't know if like 113 is guaranteed torrent, or if it's like kinda likely, but it's the point where it cuts off from being like not really worth it to worth it. I don't know the strats that intricately. I mean, they're both risks, it's just I think that if, if I do the strat 5 one, everything works out a lot nicer if, it, if that works out. Whereas strat 3, I'm kind of scrambling to get it to work in the first place, and then the strat itself is risky. Uh, yeah. I 
How many potions do I have? I have two potions. It takes me to 105. That's the other option, is to double potion. And then just pray to god that I don't need one afterwards. Which I shouldn't know. Uh, I might at 105. Ugh. And that's so slow. Double potion, because I'd have to do one before the fight. At least, so I might as well do both before the fight. No, I think I'll go for... I'll go for powder and... Powder and strap fight. And we'll see how bad it goes, and it'll be a learning experience next time. X speed and powder. Expect revive castle. High roll, please. Oh, that looked okay. Yo, Drowls, two years. Thank you very much, my dude. Luna Memento, I am doing some shit at the moment. <laughs> I will be with you shortly. Good. No ancient power. Nobody crit, but Claydol high roll. Thank you. Drowls for 24 fucking months. I'll have to make. Oh, that is a low fucking roll on that seat. Zatu. Please high roll player. That looks good. That looks very fucking good. I need to high roll the Zatu there. I'm really worried that I'm about to miss that range. That first roll was terrible. Okay. Wow. I need to actually make a two year sub badge. Bollocks! Lose time here because um, Shiru does the market trip after TNL. We did it before. And we crit the Lunatone. No range there, thank god. It actually isn't the best split. Damn, that's a shame. It felt kind of fast. I'm surprised it's not better. Nothing really went that wrong by the time we got to TNL. I just said, um, Shiru doesn't do the market trip until afterwards. Yeah, pretty much. He splits okay. That market trip is a decent timeout. I'd say you'll be able to see how close it is after true double, but Shiru's true double is pretty meh. So we tend to save time overall. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. So. I think my health's good. It actually looked kind of low. <laughs> it seemed almost too low, which is insane, considering I went in with too high HP. Oh no, never mind. 45. That is Torrent, and that will hold Torrent. That is like, really fucking good HP. I think the play, if we get double Dragon Rage in the future, is to just do Strat 5 and hope you get high rolls. That is close, to be fair. If I, if he'd have done... Four less damage, I wouldn't have Torrent. In fact, am I going to level out at 45? I said it was fine, it might not be. 52. Yeah, fuck! I think I'm going to level out by 1 HP. At 45. 
I really want damage in True Double. I really want Golbat or Crobat to get a turn at me. Which is counterintuitive. <laughs> I normally don't. I think I am 1 HP off. Because if it plus 3s, it'll go to 52 out of 155. And that's 1 HP too low. And there's no way it plus 2s. I just don't know when we get 40. I think we get 45 in True Double. Ooh, that's an issue. <laughs> Ooh, that's a real fucking issue, actually. I want to see an early Crobat <laughs> in this fight. Yeah, we almost certainly get it in the fight. Oh dear. We have to lose another run to Tree Double. I didn't want damage it last time. Because it was going to kill me. I do want damage this time. <laughs> and I bet I don't get it. Sam. It might be late on into the fight that I get the level up there. Nice credit, idiot. Because I'm going to be about halfway here. I won't get it off of the camera up to my Tiena, that's for sure. The form of a crit, fuck up. Can I survive a crit? I can survive air cutter crit. I can, I can survive Golbat crit as well, although I'm not favoured to. No, I, I can always survive Golbat crit, actually. It's only Crobat crit with wing attack. The problem is, is that he's got... The AI has no reason to attack me over Metang, so it's a 50-50. Who it will choose to attack. If it gets a turn, is the other fun part. So the ideal here is that we bop camera up to Mighty Ender initially and it sends Crobat out straight away. And it decides to target me. Man, we are in RNG's grasp here. I don't actually know what to do if I don't get Torrent as a heads up. I think we just die to Archie. It's a dead meta in the board, man. That would be quite slow. What was the last item I used? X special. Nope. Something else. Right here. This would not be a bad time actually for take the two percent takedown from camera up. Was that both of them? That's good. Yes! Yes! Is that good? Yes! Let's fucking go, camera up! Yes! Oh, that's so fucking good. <laughs> I didn't get the Mighty Ender range, that's a shame. I do die, actually. I'm in exactly the same scenario as yesterday, where I do die to Crobat max roll wing attack. <laughs> he can still get me again. Uh, that's good. If he'd have crit, that'd have been amazing. These both just died to surf now. Attack the Mighty Enna, please? Actually, yeah, definitely attack the Mighty Enna. Don't attack Golbat, because he's sending out a camera. Uh, no, he's sending out Mighty Enna that dies. Yeah, bot needs a sub. Come on, attack the Crobat. Attack the Crobat. Really? Still attack the Crobat. We got Mean Look. Good shit. Attack the Crobat. I crit the Crobat. Suck my dick. I don't care. You don't need to attack anything. Everything dies from here. What an excellent fight. <laughs> Is that bad? No, that's totally good. Psychic makes no difference unless you want to oh, crit when they're killed. Wow. That was slow. Uh, I have three served. Yeah, that's good. Neat. Good fight. Very close to best. Wow, PBs is pretty good. I didn't realise that. Wow, yeah, we literally tied Shiru <laughs> across TNL and True Double. His True Double fight is not good, though. So my TNL split must have been meh.
because my true double fight was fine. Not brilliant, but fine. Yeah, Crit Crobat was good there. It would have been really bad if Camrot hadn't take down. Oh, this menu sucks. I hate this menu so much. Worst menu in the game coming up. Sizzle, if you're about, those are the scrolls that I sometimes can do on console and sometimes can't. <laughs> that I always can do on emulator, and I don't know why. They looked pretty good there. But I swear, they're so much easier on emulator. Yeah, it is on BizHawk, to be fair. I do need to check if it's just a busy thing. Bizhawk via Swiss. No, uh, on my computer. Getting on the bike. Uh, this is the last uh, fight I can die to until champion. Apart from the world's slimmest chance of dying to Juan, I guess. Yeah, Moncares. This fight is really scary. <laughs> I actually fucking hate it. I hate everything about this goddamn fight. I've seen this before. I've seen it three times in a row in a race. Darkness is deep when it comes to Archer. Hey, Mikael. Um, powders, where are they? They're up. Not very far, though. I have not used a powder yet this run. I, mean, I do have good HP here. I can actually tank a crit if it happens. Speed special. Alright. Don't crit me. GG's. Uh, yeah, I could gold this by a bit, I think. I've never really executed a good Archie split. Like, this may be a gold? It won't be Shiru's. Shiru's Archie split is insanely good. I actually don't exactly know how Shiro outpaces me in the Archie split every time. I'm, I'm wondering if the true double split is off by a little bit. No, no crafted special, thank fuck. It's quite nice to be on PB pace past Archie. Are 
It's certainly not going to be an astounding PB, even if it is the PB. But it's quite nice. Mm, yeah, but PB also loses 25 seconds in the Sydney split. I just get Dude, I was there yesterday. I was basically there until Maxi 2 fucked me over. And then True Double put the final nail in the coffin. Is this ping worthy? Up to you. I don't mind either which way. Why has this not been pinged? It is only a 30 second lead, to be fair. Oh, really? Really? Bro. <sighs> That's the rust showing through. I haven't been here in a while. It's been a hot minute <laughs> since I, uh, I've been to this part of the run. I hate being in runs. I... Yeah. I don't, I'm I'm indifferent. I don't like being Marty and being like, oh, I don't like it because people do like it. So I'm just not that fussed. I've pinged some runs before for other people. I think I pinged a Wawa run a little while back because it was looking good, and then he got shafted by Flow Timer. Speaking of which. Yeah, the, the Gen 1 to 3 Discord server has a, a Hype Runs channel. In fact, I think every Discord server has a Hype Runs channel now. Um, you can ping a roll and let people know that X Runner is on good run here. Yeah. Thanks, Ginger. People spam there a lot? Uh, I disagree. I think, considering how much of a free-for-all we basically left it in the rules, I think people use it fairly sensibly. The only time we've actually said anything against what people have done is when somebody pinged multiple times for the same run. I was like, nah, there's no need for that, dude. Oh, Bonkless Cave of Origin. Excellent. Actually harder than it looks. <laughs> Damon. No, we would never. I've got no interest in policing enthusiastic people. I'd rather people were excited for speedruns. Is my take on that situation. Pace Pal has arrived. Hands up, Pace Pals. I 
no shame here. I am the finest pace pal on Twitch. Welcome, my good friends. Thanks, Kurt. Sancho <laughs> just like... It's fine. It's unreasonable to expect you to be here a lot of the time. Totally fine to just show up for good pace, don't worry about it. I pull a one right at the last second. Alright, goodbye chat for a bit until Ray's done. I'm just gonna let flow timer run once, because I don't want a wow wow special. I really need a wee. I really don't appreciate the rain in this cutscene because I need a wee. Why does that not look right? That ray offset's wrong. I'm fairly certain. What the fuck is happening? No? Is it seriously that long? Am I might freaking myself out? I'm freaking myself out. No, that's fine. I've never changed it, I've never written anything in it, and it matches what I have written in my splits. I just did not realise that cutscene was that fucking long. Okay, let's not do anything dumb. <laughs> Calm down. Come on. Oh, this is quite bad. Oh, this is hefty. Eee, not good RNG. I'm shocked that you wait that long for Rayquaza to happen. It's crazy. <laughs> it just feel, felt too long when I was sat waiting for it in the cutscene there. It'd been really funny if I'd have got an encounter on that one time. Sky Pillar 2. I have not fallen in Sky Pillar in so fucking long. Oh my god, I've fallen twice! Oh no, this was going really well as well. It was one bonk up until this room. Fucking god, I have not fallen in Sky Pillar for so fucking long. That's embarrassing. Other than the fall, it's pretty good. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Fucked. Ruined. This room dead. Fuck it. Split is horrific. <laughs> this has been so fucking bad. I think I'm actually losing most of my lead, if not all of it. I'm worried that was slightly early. I'm hoping it was just early enough to be brave one. And not relaxed. God, you do wait here for so long. okay with that, but I wouldn't be surprised if it pops. Like two shakes. Mm -hmm. Welcome back, chat. Two 
236. What the fuck is that? Adamant? Okay. It wasn't even that early. Get the fuck on. <laughs> Fucking Christ. Right, just to, to point out to anybody that thinks that the Emerald requires a manip is bad. I fucking hate that bit. I just did not expect to have cancelled the turn frame there. I don't understand that set of conversations. Do anybody that thinks the Emerald requires Manip is bad? My execution in this run has been shit. Absolute fucking trash. The entire goddamn run. It's an embarrassment that this is even PB pace. I have never missed requires a Manip on PB pace. Ever. I will do, at some point. That is a, a biased example. At some point I will miss it on PB base, but until now, I've yet to miss it. It is really not that bad. This manip is, like, fine. Adam again. I'm probably going to lose all the time that PB lost in the Sydney split. This is going to PB by like 8 seconds, I want to know. Where's God Item Command? Exclamation mark protein. Oh, this split was the best split in my PB. I'm fairly sure I missed the fly, didn't I? Oh, neat. Ice Beam's good. Me likey. A reminder that Persian Berry is for stupid people. Just hit fly, LMAO. Is there a free frame a three frame for race that's one that's better? Uh possibly. There are other windows. Um Exarion's Ray Minip pace bin is after the change from a shitter range to this better range. You might want to check. The, he lists a whole bunch of ranges in that. You may want to go and check what's there. But to be honest, I don't really care that much. Adamant's fine. Like, quiet sucks, but I hit Adamant or Brave nearly every time. Like, Brave won, so... The other thing is, is that this has a lot of buffer. The fact that Brave 2 and both relaxed... Like, Brave 2 is still really fucking good. And then both of the relaxed are, like, actually fine. Like, not too bad. <laughs> There's always an Exarion pace bin. Yeah, it just happens to be the the Ray pace bin was his... Uh, one where he figured out swapping to this new window is the better option. So it has a lot of his workings out. <laughs> I almost forgot what I was doing in this menu. Muscle memory properly kicked in there. Is this a good Rayquaza? Yes, it's the third best. That was very slow. Did I do everything in that menu? Is that everything? Is there something else I normally do? I haven't been here in so long. Is there something else? Wave, is there something else I do in that menu? Is it just... TMHM Repel. I feel like there's a full thing. No, that's it. I actually have that menu still in my notes. I'm just freaking myself out again. Nice. A bit like I almost did with the, uh, the Ray Offset. Which one's the worst? The Quiet, because... We're not buying the extra X special. Although this run could have bought the extra X special, I just forgot. Yeah, thanks, wave. 
wave, this one did early experience. Fun fact. That <laughs> was level 14 for Roxanne. It also got protein. This was the safest run going. You've never seen a more safe run. I could have picked up the person, but that's disgusting. Yeah, there's... Uh, there's nearly... Well, I never, I've never hit relaxed in a EV attempt. So there's only really four Rayquazas you can get. That's right, Maquin. Correct him on that. It's the only one I go for. I might go for a level four routes at some point, but I know it's got growl, and that sucks ass. But I might see, because that does give enough experience as well, apparently. It's just so good. It just... It's like, yeah, you lose a smidge of time to fight in the low tab, but now the rest of your Roxanne split is going to be, like, fine, as a bare minimum. It's an extremely weird place for the Repel to wear off. Shouts to falling twice in Skyville. Can I still PB? I'm literally ahead of my PB. Yeah, Aqua Pooch. The fact that the second Geo dude like has three moves instead of one, so you never have to heal, or well, it's like extremely, extremely unlikely that you ever have to heal after the Petalburg heal, makes all your potion counts good. Level 14 for nose pass is insane a lot of the time. Nice bonk. Nice bonk again. Nice bonk again! Let's go. I am excellent at video games. I wonder if the repel will last. I may run out like two tiles early, which would be fun. Is this the hardest bike movement in the run? No. I don't think so. Sky Pillar 2 is harder. Um, it's probably the second hardest, to be fair. The movement itself isn't too bad. It's actually fairly forgiving. It's just the fact that you can't really see anything. You have to. Nice. Oh my god, I'm just so early. This has been terrible. Winona splits the hardest movement? No. It is the most punishing, though. You will lose runs if you fuck up the Winona split movement. Which you don't really get anywhere else. Like, I fucked up royally in Sky Pillar 2 and just lost, like, 20 seconds. I can't believe I'm on pace to PB by 8 seconds again. <laughs> My last two PBs were eight seconds each. I don't get 231 off of this, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> this run kinda went to shit after, uh... well, it was, it was kinda never really good, but it went to shit in the Juan split. I think it's just a bit of rust because I've not been in here, been here in so long. Like my victory road movement was trash so far. Yes, current PB is the clutch champ but it also loses 25 seconds in this split. Although, I'm very likely to lose the same amount of time because I have the same Rayquaza. Well, not very likely, but whatever. I'm more likely than, are you serious? Other Rayquazas to lose that time? Oh, yeah, I have to talk to these boulders. So yeah, I really need a good lead here. Otherwise we're going to be risking champion again. And it's not going to give me double blizz miss again. Alright, PB got double protect from this Pelipper. If I can get none, we save like 15 seconds. Yeah. So that's a good start. Fuck Pelipper. Dude. 
Get off. Oh my god, I can't risk that. <laughs> Fuck's sake. This was trash. <laughs> this victory road was the worst one I've done in a long while. <sighs> Whatever. I hope I bonked into them though. I got the text box extremely early. the one that was world record pace into champion and got frozen. World, world record-ish pace. It's a big ish. I will not hit this range. Unless I crit. Okay, it is a range with the adamant. That is neat. I also hit it, which is extremely fucking neat. This run needed that. That's very fucking good. Going to save like 15 seconds. Second best Elite Four theme only to Black and White. Do Black and White and Black and White 2 have the same Elite Four theme? If they do, then I agree. I can't remember if they do or not. Yes, then yeah, okay, I agree. I'm down with that opinion. Bodied by Shiru's supreme movement happens. I was never going to get a very good split here. <laughs> Victory Road was trash. Right, my problem, chat, is that I am quite likely to lose 25 seconds to champion. <laughs> uh, that's my entire lead. I actually need champion to go quite well. Yeah, I don't like the Oras thing. I, but then Oras does kick off the Elite Four with the sickest Wally theme going. Like, it's so fucking good, the Wally theme. One of the best themes in all of Pokemon. Another 232, yeah, probably. This is actually very likely to miss 231, in a way. Double. Oh, okay, you failed. That's not too bad. Uh, we'll take that. I love getting double protect, so good. Yeah, I mean, it's good that they only played it once. But it is a fucking banger theme when it kicks off. It's nice for speedruns as well, because you don't hear it too often. If it was every Wally fight, that would be a bit much. That, like, toothless, etchy LMAO is the worst thing in the world, though. I fucking hate that MO. It's awful. PB goes hairless, doesn't it? I'm fairly certain. Uh, this might just be impossible to PB without like the same sick champion fight. If I get hail here. I forgot that this was a thing. Oh, we got hailless again. Mm. Easy. 191. <laughs> What's the range on Wallace? Nice crap. 159 to 188. Oh, that's good HP. Do not need to heal as long as we don't get rocked in. The whole gang's here. Uh, 
Don't miss fire, that is a great idea. Actually, I would like to uh, have a tribute to my favourite Emerald Speedrunner, Wave Warrior, by missing fire. This would be a totally fine run to miss fly on. Oh, that's a shame. I'm like totally down for this to just not be me. <laughs> if it happens, it happens. Whatever. This is another like really mediocre run that I've just kept alive just. Why was that so much slower than my BB? Oh, I crit a few things, didn't I? Rock Tomb is dead PB for show. How did I lose 8 seconds here? What's going on with my splits? How did I lose 8 seconds in the Drake split? Uh, yeah, this is literally the first attempt of the day. First mudkip. Was this second try mudkip as well? Yeah, fuck, this was second try mudkip as well. <laughs> I forgot about that. This was early experience on second try. That's a double protect. I said the, the rock sand split doesn't really reflect that because it's like a 17 3, 36, I think. I was going to say 3x, but I'm fairly sure it's a 36. Looks a lot better than the strats should <laughs> suggest. I think my aerial ace PP is fine to do a good strat and champ. Yep. It's basically only uh, double protect from dust blocks that changes that. Happened in Shuri's PB, he got rock tuned. Very slow. Would not recommend. Am I going to YOLO champ? Have a host that doesn't show? Thank you, Scar. If I didn't have my live split covering the thing, I would have seen it. Thanks, JP. There is no real YOLOing champ. I survived Blizzard on this health every time. Um. Yeah. If he misses, then it's a PB. I don't need double, I just, but one miss is definite PB. I don't know how close it is if he doesn't miss. Because I do have to heal on Gyarados if he doesn't. Confused about my Drake Gold? I am also. Oh, no, I'm not confused. I don't know why PB lost like two seconds, but Drake Gold gets... Uh, Rock Tomb turn 2, so it doesn't protect. So you save the time there. Rain Dance is a great fucking option. Oh, we take that. Can't freeze me, can't crit me. It's about the same speed as getting hit, except I don't have to heal on Gyarados. This run finishes, boys. I literally cannot die now, unless I fuck up. Whether it's a PB, I don't know. I don't know how much time this will lose. Because Rain Dance is fairly slow with all the text. It loses 10 seconds to the text. Mm, I don't know. I outspeed Gyarados. Yeah, because it's the Adamant. Neat. Thank you, Wade, for finding that one out. That will help. But he's very likely to Dragon Dance because he's got nothing that kills. Surf is actually probably... Uh, no, because the Dragon Dance text takes a while. Yep, that's actually a pretty good option. GG, finished run. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm fairly sure there's PBs. I don't see me losing 26 seconds. Do I lose... 18 though, so that it doesn't 231, that'd be fun. That is gonna be close. Please can I have a 231? Please?
Nice crit. If that crit cost me 231, I'm gonna murder a wish catch. It didn't. Yay! I hate this PB. <laughs> this run was trash. This run was hot garbage. I hate everything about it. Although these splits are fairly nice to run against, there really isn't any good split. <laughs> it's almost such a backwards compliment. There really isn't a good split here. Like, so these these are totally fine to run against. None of these splits were good, except for maybe Archie 2. But I'm always good in Archie 2. <laughs> Speeder is hating their PVs. Name a more iconic duo. This is this is god awful. I played like absolute garbage. The fat 20 seconds lost in Juan was it entirely my fault. The It doesn't look like it, but the like 5-10 seconds for of time lost in Sydney, entirely my fault. Uh pretty much wave, sorry. <laughs> well you do you, I didn't get unlucky, really. The, the look in this run was pretty fucking good. But yeah, I mean Please keep please take second try. This literally was second try. And the run was trash. And it was safe as fuck. And it was like a high 231. Like, please don't keep resetting over first try, it's so pointless. <laughs> wow Huang, toxic. I have 69 viewers. Nice. Thank you everybody for dropping in. I won't be doing anything more today, I don't think. What time is it? Yeah, 20 past. 20 past 10. Well, that's a good start. I'm really looking forward to next week because I have all week off work and I don't have anything particularly planned. So it's just going to be attempts for most of the week. And we're starting off relatively early with a nice PB. Let's have a look at the splits. So yeah, Roxanne, that is actually an astoundingly good Roxanne time, but it kind of shows off how good early experience is. Because this was second try Mudkip. It was one encounter, but obviously I have to kill the Lotad, which takes three turns. Um, but then there was no magic crit or anything on Nose Pass, and I still got a mid-17. That's, like, really fucking good. <laughs> Early experience is incredibly fucking powerful. Doofud Rival 2. Doofud was good. I had Torrent, and... I haven't split because of early experience. You get the level, you get the evolution before the split, but rather than in Rival 2. But I had Torrent, and I got Normie Bird off of Chain, so... That was fine. Rival 2 was kind of shit. Everything else went pretty well, but... I got 5 turn sleep on Slugma again, like the 4th time in a row. Um, Watson was shit. I got a 5 turn Ben fight. Uh, sand Attack into Water Gun miss, into Growl into Mudshot, Miss Range, into Watergun. That was really bad. Uh, Maxi one was kind of crap because the spinners fucked me, kind like a little bit crap because my execution wasn't brilliant. It wasn't bad, but it wasn't brilliant. And then I picked up Protein, so I lost more time. Brawly was shit because I ran through an extra bit of grass and got an encounter. God, this run is so bad. <laughs> Execution's terrible. The Norman split's good, but that's luck. Uh, luck and Protein. What's that, 620? Yeah, 620. Um, actually not the best with Protein. What did I, what happened in this? Oh, the Norman fight was good, but the Jody fight, I missed the range the first time, so four shot it. Yeah, I mean, I'm, don't get me wrong, I'm not... I don't like my PB, but I'm glad I got it. Like, it's nice to have PB'd, and nice to be in the 231 crew. Finally. <laughs> Even though I'm still just scraping my way in. Thanks for all the GG's, guys. Um... Yeah, so Norman was pretty lucky. Uh, Rival 3 was good. 3 hit the Pelipper, I imagine a world. How did, I, how did this run PB with so many bad splits? Because my PB wasn't that good before this. Like, And I just held it together. Winona was okay. Um, yeah, there was a couple of dodgy... Like, the, the gym trainer double fight wasn't great. I got Protect from the Pelipper. And I missed the Carvana range on the one before this. Thanks, Jenkins. I hope so. I just need to play a bit better. Uh, Maxi 2 was good. I'm always good in that split though. I like, never really have an off day in that split. Oh no, I, I uh, the very first thing was I'm supposed to repel right before a spinner and I actually just ran right past it and didn't get caught. So no, never mind, that was trash. TNL was okay. Uh, I actually can't complain too much about that. I did kind of get shit HP, but then TNL was friendly. True Double was really lucky. 
um, because I was going to level out of Torrent, but then I got the 4% takedown from Camerot. Very nice. Archie was okay. I'm still really disappointed with how how I'm not golding this split. I need to actually compare with Shiru's because he like beats me by four seconds every t every goddamn time, and I don't know why. Oh, I do pause minute. Oh, that's not going to help actually. We do pause minute the spinner, and he doesn't do that. That does account for a little bit of it. Okay. Juan was terrible. I fell down on Sky Pillar twice. Uh, first time since coming back last year. That I've fallen down in Sky Pillar. I did it twice. Wally was fine. Uh, Sydney v Victory Road movement was kind of crap, but uh, I hit the range LMAO, so there's all my time save. And yeah, Elite Four. So yeah. Thank you, Dexy. Thank you for watching. Uh, let's go raid somebody. It's a nice, easy stream. I literally started up, got one mudkip on second try and PB'd. Easy peasy. Just PB straight away. Genius. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Let's go. Head Bob. Head Bob's doing Auras, that's a good one. Raid. Head Bob. Yeah, Crafted's got more viewers. Well, he's got about the same amount of viewers as I have right now. It's going to make more of an impact to Head Bob. He's on about 50 viewers, I think. But thank you, Howl. Where is he, Noras? He's about an hour in. I don't know where that is. Uh, it looks like he's past the rival two split, so I think he's in Watson. Although that's the thumbnail, he might be a little bit further ahead. I may stream tomorrow, I may not. I don't know yet. Let's see how I feel. <laughs> 